welcome to Matt's Lockpit. So today's video should be a short video for you. Um, basically, I'm just going to show you a quick hack for your lock pits, your lock labs, your lock pads, workbenches, masturbation stations, whatever the fuck you want to call them. But it's cheap and it's easy, so I thought I'd share it with you guys. After that, I'm going to be opening up a package. It's actually something I've ordered myself from uklockpickers.co.uk. I don't normally do videos of stuff that I've ordered for myself. However, I am quite excited to see these in the flesh. I have wanted a set, so I thought I'd share it with you guys. So, a hack, you say? Well, a lot of you are going to think I'm a fucking idiot for a second. Because it literally is as simple as a doormat on your bench. And I know what the f I know what you're thinking. What the fuck are you on about, Matt? You've lost your marbles here. Um, however... Bear with me, I'll show you exactly what I mean. You see the little uh, flat bar pry bars? I don't know whether it's just me, but I really struggle to pick these up off my workbench. But with having this mat here, I can literally bang, bang, bang. I don't know whether everyone has this problem, anyone else has this problem, but it is a major problem for me. Key easily. Little 15,000 sparrows. These little fuckers are impossible to pick up sometimes, but as simple as that. Shims, I'm sure a lot of you watching this video will at one stage or another had sweaty hands and your shims have been on your workbench and you can't pick the little fuckers up. But with this mat, it's easy. And I'll I'll show you the difference now, I'll just slide the mat forward a bit. And I'm not faking at all here, guys, because what would be the point? But let me just show you what it's normally like for me to pick up these pry bars. Two-handed. That's a fucking ball ache, that is. There's no need to do that. Especially if you're um, in the middle of picking a lock. Ah, it can be annoying as hell. All right, these little sparrows, bear steals. What I have to do with these little fuckers is I normally have to slide them to the edge of my workbench so I can pick them up. The shims aren't always so bad because they are caved, so you can get them. But yeah, for the sake of just having a mat there, it fucking makes stuff a lot easier. And it actually looks quite decent. I don't know what you think about that, but I think that looks better than my workbench. You can hoover it, do what the fuck you want with it. So yeah, for three quid, I think that's a, quite a cool hack. So I thought I'd share it with you guys. So anyways, uh, let's show you guys what I've ordered from uklockpickers.co.uk. I've ordered two things. I'll show you them both. I'll save the best for last, though. Apologies for that. Um, made the schoolboy error of not turning my phone to aeroplane mode and received a motherfucking phone call halfway through my video. Doesn't matter, we'll crack on. Doesn't make a difference. So as I said, I got two packages from uklockpickers.co.uk. Ordered these not yesterday, the day before, in the afternoon. So um, they've got here really quick, as they always do. <coughs> there we go. As you can see, this is just a set of honest dimple picks. I know what you're thinking, what the hell are you doing buying honest dimple picks while sparrows have just brought out their black flags? Well, I'll be honest with you guys, the price that UK lock pickers have got on some of their dimple picks at the moment, you cannot say no. Um, I've been living in the dark ages for a while, and I've been using my homemade flags for a good while. But if I'm honest with you, um, I've always had good results of them, so I mean, I've never bothered buying a dedicated set. But as I said, at the price that UK lock pickers have got some of their dimple picks at the moment, you cannot say no. Um, from what I've heard, with a bit of works, sanding and filing, etc., these can be turned into very effective picks. So, um, yeah, we'll give them a go. They look nice, colour-coded handles and whatnot. So, uh, yeah, this is what I've been waiting for. I've already opened up the envelope, but I haven't opened up what's inside. So if anyone is after cheap dimple picks, I would get yourself over to uklockpickers.co.uk as soon as possible, because they're not going to be there for that much longer at the price they're selling them. Brilliant price. As you can see here, we have a leather pouch with UKLP on the front. Very cool. And as many of you will already guessed, this is the UKLP pick set. Very cool. 
as you can see we have red black and blue the reds are 25 thousandths the blacks are a mirror of the red ones but only in 15 thousandths and as you can see at the back there we've got some nice rakes in blue i believe they're 25 thousandths as well i'm not going to give these a review guys because there's plenty of more competent pickers who have already done it and i know there's some that will plan to do it so if i get these to focus i'll just show you through some of them that's nice uklp on the handle nice color red got the forest diamond here let's have a little feel of that oh that's very smooth and sides that's actually a lot smoother than it looks I think what you can see on the side guys is literally just dirt and uh, I don't even think this needs finishing with any sandpaper I think it'll literally just polish it up with a cloth and she'll be good to go that's a very impressive finish fair play for the price of these picks I wasn't expecting that so that's a red one let's have a look at a black one uh, we'll grab this one on the end she looks like a euro hook I'd call that rather than a short hook so let's have a feel of this well that's even smoother than the first that one definitely doesn't need any sandpaper to finish it literally just a cloth and that'll be ready UKLP inside of the black handle very cool nice so uh, let's have a look at these rakes I know a lot of you guys are purists and don't actually like the rakes well that's cool that's like a mini bogata but I myself love rakes and um, you probably can't appreciate the size of this uh, on the video but this is very small this is going to fit in some locks that you'd normally struggle with so yeah very cool tool that'll come in very handy as i said i love rakes in the real world when i get a call for a lockout i'll always reach for a rake before i reach for a hook and that's very nice and blue so yeah i'm really happy with the finish on these for the price of these picks you cannot go wrong obviously i haven't tried them in the lock yet but they look very promising i'm very impressed with that this pouch is awesome as well, feels nice, and that'll actually genuinely probably fit in your pocket. So, very cool. Thank you, UK Lockpickers, for the amazing service, as always. And um, don't forget, UK Lockpickers does actually have a Facebook page as well as their shop. A uh, lot of very cool guys on there, people from all over the world. It's a good laugh. Come and join us. So, um, yeah, just show you what we got again. And don't forget to uh, uh, get yourself a mat, guys. comes in very handy. So, um... Thanks for watching, please like, please subscribe, and I'll uh, see you all again, and I'll be sticking these UK lock pickers, picks in a lock, and uh, giving you a picking video. So, take it easy guys, I'll see you all soon.